Social media has made the world more connected than ever, but with all this access to excess, could social media be doing more harm than good? If this is your first time visiting The Taco, click the red subscribe button below. Today, we are discussing 10 ways social media is ruining our lives. In the moment. From recording concerts on your smartphone to taking pictures of your food, we are all guilty of worrying about our social media feeds instead of enjoying the moment we are in. It can get so bad that it can even affect your memory. A study has shown that when people record a situation such as a concert or a night out on their camera phones instead of just observing it while they're there, they are less likely to remember the event the next day. This just proves that it's time to put down the phones and enjoy the world and the people around you. Egomaniacs because of social media, we have turned the world into the me show for everyone to watch. Whether it's through likes from a selfie or going to an event just to show how interesting our lives are, people are constantly finding ways to feed their egos through social media. Many studies have found the use of social media has raised the level of narcissism in college students. This means that many young people are flooding the world with their inflated feelings of self-importance and unjustified entitlement just because they get a little attention online. FOMO Growing up, it's not a common to have the fear of missing out, or FOMO. But when it starts to transition into your adulthood, there may be a problem. Social media has made it easier than ever to see people the same age as us getting married, having babies, or traveling the world. This can make us think we are missing out on important milestones in life and can cause some serious depression. If you're experiencing FOMO, it's good to remember that we all have different life journeys, and your social media feeds don't always show the full picture. Jealousy Not to be confused with FOMO, jealousy is a whole other issue that can rear its head when it comes to social media. Have you ever seen the girl with the perfect body, perfect boyfriend, and perfect life online? The rise of lifestyle envy is a real problem thanks to social media. It seems like others have cuter pets, nicer homes, or cooler vacations because those are the only things they ever post. This can cause many to feel inadequate and raises the chances they will become obsessed with the image they're portraying online. Pettiness there is so much pettiness on social media that it can get exhausting. From unfriending someone for their political views to people getting anxiety over a silly social media post, the pettiness has gotten out of hand. It seems like the world has forgotten that social media isn't real life. And just because someone unfriends you, it doesn't mean they don't value you. It's time that people focus their energy on things that matter, like being healthy and maintaining relationships offline and away from fickle Facebook and other social media timelines. TMI Have you have you ever looked back on your timeline and cringed when you saw, went to the grocery store, now time for Netflix? Social media has made it easier than ever to share every detail of our lives, no matter how boring they can be. But sharing too much information about your life online can actually have its potential dangers. From posting rants about work or getting tagged in questionable photos, everyone should be careful when it comes to sharing too much info on social media. We now have to think before we post, since everything is out there for the world to see, it can come back to haunt you. Wasting time. Whether you are at work or trying to get your homework done, social media can become a major distraction. Checking timelines on various social networks and reading the latest news has become an addiction that can even rival drug or alcohol use. Spending too much time online can throw off sleeping patterns and promote antisocial behaviors. The trouble with this is people become so obsessed with checking their timelines that it gets in the way of work, school, and spending time with their loved ones. Spread of misinformation It's clearer than ever that social media networks can shape the world around us with just the click of the share button. There has been a rise of websites created just for that purpose of engineering viral content, whether the content is factual or not. This can be potentially very dangerous. The world saw a very social media-driven U.S. presidential election in 2016, and the spread of misinformation from both sides was staggering. Many have speculated that the results of the election are because of all the information that was spread on social media media that no one took the time to fact check. According to Facebook, they are working on ways to stop the spread of misinformation in the future. Bad for relationships Flirting with an old fling or chatting up a stranger you met online may seem harmless, but chances are if you're in a relationship, your partner may not like it. Social media has connected more people than ever and raised the level of temptation in the process. Studies have shown that a quarter of the couples fight about social media weekly, and the fights can lead to one in seven couples discussing divorce. There's also been a rise of trust issues in relationships as partners don't share passwords and can even have secret social media accounts. Cyberbullying 
The fact that there is some anonymity online can bring out a dark side of people that may be suppressed in the real world. Grade school kids and teens are most susceptible to cyberbullying, and the outcome can be mentally scarring. Cyberbullying on social media can be so devastating that it has driven people to feel as if they're isolated and can no longer go on. 42% of teens say they have been the victims of online bullying. It's gotten so bad that most states in the U.S. have passed legislation that makes online harassment illegal and punishable by anything from school suspension to actual jail time. What do you think? Is social media ruining your life? React in the comment section below, and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to The Taco.